All right, so we want to prove the identity. We want to verify the lefts like the right. So to do that, what I'm going to do here is multiply the bottom. I'm going to multiply the bottom and the top on the left by, don't multiply this, one minus cosine t and one plus cosine t, one minus cosine t. So I get sine for one minus cosine t. And on the bottom, I get one minus cosine squared t. So this is a trig identity. <laughs> it's the same thing as sine squared theta or sine squared t. So I get sine t times one minus cosine t. And this becomes sine squared t. So one of these sine squared t's, it just becomes sine t. Cancels out and we just get sine, uh, we just get uh, one minus cosine t on top and that's how we end up with one minus cosine t over sine t. And that's it. That's here. All right, I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching, have a great day.